the question is who has killed Athar Mateen is that a routine robbery incident or someone is behind this crime this is the question of uh, this video which will be raised and we will try to find out who is uh, really behind the killing of uh, Mati. I am Vaseem Raza from Italy and you are watching Global TV. Athar was killed during a robbery amid rising street crimes in the city. His brother Tarek Mateen who is also a journalist says personnel of law enforcement agencies were involved in the crime and Mateen was shot dead by a trained shooter. Rachi police chief claims he has some clues about the killers and will arrest them. He has formed an investigation team under West Deputy Inspector General Police. Sami was the most kind-hearted person who would guide his junior. These are the comments of his colleagues at Sama TV. Because of Karachi street crime, we lost our best hard work colleague. Couldn't control myself. Sama Sheikh tweeted later with a nearing clip that shows her in tears. His funeral prayers was offered at Clifton's Al Sadiqi Mosque at 2 p.m. Saturday. The journalist's family members, President Araf Ilvi and Sindh Governor Imran Ismail, were among many who attended the funeral. The question remains. Who is behind the killing of uh, Atamutin, a peaceful journalist? PPP leader Said Ghani has uh, admitted that there are criminal elements in the Sin police. Commenting on the death of Mateen, MKM leader Amir Khan has said that those who are involved in the criminal activities in Karachi are not local, they are outsiders. This is the responsibility of the government to control these elements. Whether they are street criminals or the criminals in the police department, it is clear that the Sun police has been unable to control the street criminals, but the killing of a peaceful journalist, Atta Mateen, shows that there is definitely some conspiracy to dismantle the law and order of the city. The question is whether PPP government and Sindh police has capacity and interest of arrest of the killers of Mateen or even this case will remain unsolved like so many other high profile kill cases in Karachi. Take care till next especially if you live in Karachi.